Leslie with Metro Waste Authority, and I guess you could kind of call me a recycling know-it-all because I manage the curb it, curbside recycling program for residents in the Des Moines metro area. We get a lot of questions about whether something is recyclable or is not recyclable, and so we're going to start a fun video series called To Recycle It, To Not Recycle It, That Is The Question. Today we're going to focus on glass. I'm going to test your knowledge a little bit and give you just a little bit of information about why something is or is not recyclable. So here I have a clear spaghetti jar and here a clear Pyrex dish. Which of these, if either, is recyclable in your Kerbit cart? If you said the clear spaghetti jar, then you are correct. The Pyrex dish does not belong and we'll talk about a little bit more why later. Here we have a glass cup and a glass plate. So what's your answer? If you said neither, then you're correct. Here I have some colored glass. I have a beverage bottle and a ceramic mug. What's your final answer? If you said the beverage bottle is recyclable and the ceramic mug is not, then you're right. And here's why. Some glass is actually considered a contaminant, such as this ceramic mug. It only takes four quarter size pieces of this material to contaminate an entire semi-load full of glass. In fact, the only glass that is accepted in our curvy carts are glass bottles and jars. And some people are surprised to learn that we do accept every color of bottle. So whatever color of glass you have, go ahead and throw it in your curvy cart. I hope I've cleared up some of your glass recycling questions, but if you ever have any questions about what belong in your Kerbit cart, visit our website at www.whereitshouldgo.com and make sure to check out our next video in the series of To Recycle It or Not To Recycle It? That is the question.